I am Dr. Jay Aranam. I am a Mumbai-based breast cancer and breast oncoplasty surgeon. So today I am going to introduce you to a new term, lympha. Lympha. The full form means lymphatic microsurgical preventive healing approach. What is lympha? So let's first come to the surgical part of breast cancer. Whenever there is breast cancer, we need to address the breast as well as the axilla. For breast, there is an option of breast conservative surgery or a mastectomy based on the merits of the disease and desire of the patient. For axilla, if it is clinically N0, we can go ahead with a sentinel node biopsy where only a few nodes are excised, sent for frozen section and then decision taken as per the nodes being positive or negative. So next option is if the nodes are positive uh, for a patient, then she needs to undergo a axillary clearance. Axillary clearance involves removal of all the nodes in the axilla which not only drain the breast but also drain that sided arm hence out of say 100 patients who undergo axillary surgery around 40 of them will have some sort of problem like they might have difficulty in raising their arm they might have some pain they might have some loss of sensation they might have uh, say swelling in the arm so out of these 40, uh, with physiotherapy, majority of them will benefit and slowly their symptoms will go off. But around 5 to 10 patients will have some sort of swelling in the arm. This swelling may increase over the years. It may become chronic swelling and it may incapacitate them even in doing their daily lively activities. So, what is the solution? So, solution is lympha. Whenever we do axillary clearance, we can identify the lymphatics of the arm and connect them directly to the vein. Data shows when a lympha procedure is done, the chances of limb swelling, the risk of limb swelling, limb edema is less than 2%. So, I think you should know about this lympha you are undergoing breast cancer surgery, please do discuss it with your caregiver, with your doctor, whether lympha is an option for you. So if you have got any doubts or questions about lympha, please write down in the comment section below. Me or my team will get back to you. Thank you.